Hello, I'm April Larson, Dermatologist and Chief Medical Officer at Pathology Watch. Today I want to share some important tips and guidelines about electronic orders to help improve patient safety and workflow efficiency so your patients get the most accurate reports fast. While the specimen and requisition travel to the lab, many dermatology EMRs have the ability to send e-orders ahead to the lab. When the lab receives the e-order, the information is identical to the final information you enter into your clinic note. The physical specimen vial is easily scanned and matched to the electronic order when the specimen arrives at the lab, and then the specimen can move immediately to the next step in processing. The final report is also more likely to be received correctly through the EMR interface when e-orders are received. Currently, less than a third of the cases that arrive at the lab are accompanied by an e-order at the time the specimen is received. When the e-order is not received before the specimen arrives at the lab, it requires manual entry of the information contained in the e-order, which takes additional time and can be prone to error. If the e-order arrives after the specimen is received at the lab, the information often conflicts with the requisition that was received and printed before that order was finalized. This requires contacting the clinic to confirm which information is correct. This can sometimes take up to a day or two to confirm. Not receiving an e-order can also delay the availability of clinical notes by the pathologist, which are contained in e-orders in certain EMRs. The late e-order must also be deleted or merged with the existing manually entered case. Electronic orders can also be helpful to track specimens. If an electronic order is received and no specimen arrives, the lab will call the clinic to clarify the location of the specimen. The most common reason why clinic staff do not send e-orders is that they simply forget. Another common reason is that the provider wants more time to finish their note and documentation. One way to ensure timely electronic orders is to double check the procedures after each patient or at the end of each clinic. You can finalize the requisition and send the electronic order without finishing the note. This way, your staff can send the most updated requisition as well as the electronic order prior to the specimens being picked up. At Pathology Watch, we would like to improve communication and visibility into the status of your e-orders, as this is often performed by your support staff. In the near future, we will be sending system emails about the status of your e-orders, which we hope will help streamline communication about specimen discrepancies and other issues. It will also help us confirm that we have received all intended specimens. Partnering together will benefit patients as well as help pathologists provide the most accurate and timely diagnosis. If you have any questions about e-orders, please feel free to reach out to me anytime or also to your Pathology Watch sales rep.